New video shows the moments leading up to a collision that saw a woman injured on St. Clair West earlier today. Two children escaped serious injury. Around 1130 on St. Clair West of Dufferin, you can see a dark SUV across the street stop to pull into a parking lot. Well, on the sidewalk, the woman is pushing the stroller with two children inside. Her back is to the vehicle when it accelerates and hits her also striking a store. Police say she was briefly pinned underneath. Witnesses suggest the woman pushed the stroller out of harm's way just before the car struck her. The two children, very luckily, um, ages uh, two and five, received very minor injuries. Only one of the children had a cut to the chin. Um, this does not appear to be an intentional act at all. Um, it appears to be uh, an accident. The 82-year-old male has been taken to hospital for precautions at this point. My office manager alerted me. Uh, she was there with the uh, with the kids in the stroller, and I was just with the uh, with the caregiver. She was on the on the pavement, so I was just administering some first aid on her forehead, just trying to control some bleeding best I could do under the circumstances. The woman's injuries are considered very serious. Police say she is the caregiver of the children. The security video obtained by CTV News shows how it happened. The Pathfinder pulls up and starts to parallel park. Now watch the center of your screen. The nanny pushing the stroller with the two children passes through the frame. A split second later, the Pathfinder reverses at a high rate of speed, striking them on the sidewalk. Jillian now is fine. I mean Cheryl Catricala is a good friend of the victim. She identifies her as Jillian Mendoza, a nanny who works with a family nearby. Catrick Ellis says her friend was heading home to make lunch for the kids when it happened. In the security video, you can see people react, pulling out their phones to call 911 and running over to help. Catrick Calla has no doubt Mendoza did all she could to protect the children by pushing the stroller out of the way. Friends are calling her a hero. Mendoza is a single mother raising her daughter and supporting her parents. They have started a GoFundMe campaign. The goal is to raise $50,000. Friends say Mendoza has undergone three surgeries so far and they are praying for a full recovery.